Nina's toes, fused together in an agonizing clasp. She's enduring immense pain, right, and she laboriously separates them, one by one. But check this out, her left foot, a grimmer reality, she's a ballet dancer, committed to being the swan, undergoing rigorous training daily, no matter what, big day here, the instructor's picking the swan role, and Nina, she's really stepping up her game. The lead role, folks, it's a tough one dual portrayal, white swan's gentleness and black swan's darkness. Nina's grace on stage, captures that white swan elegance perfectly, earning big praise from the instructor. But then, the black swan part, and Nina, she just can't nail that sinister vibe. The instructor, watching her, he's not impressed, shaking his head. And boom, in comes Lily, her dance, it's explosive, full of power. The instructor sees it, she's got that black swan potential. Goes to the instructor, she's set on being the swan. The instructor kisses her, totally unexpected. She's resisting, but he smiled, satisfied. The instructor slowly approached Nina, but she couldn't bear it and pushed him away. Now it's me seducing you, but in reality, you should be seducing me, he said. It turned out he was teaching Nina how to interpret the black swan, but her performance deeply disappointed him. This scene was witnessed by her rival, Lily, who then dragged Nina to a bar. Under the influence of alcohol, Nina began to dance fervently. When she woke up the next day, she realized she had missed her chance to rehearse on stage. By the time she arrived at the theater, Lily had taken over the lead role. After the performance, Lily told Nina she was just helping her get familiar with the process. Nina questioned why Lily hadn't woken her up last night, but Lily claimed she hadn't seen Nina at all. Feeling the pressure, Nina began to hallucinate, growing feathers on her body and her feet starting to twist. When she woke up, she realized it was all an illusion. Nevertheless, she decided to continue with the performance. The first act was the white swan, and a nervous Nina made a mistake. Despite this, she persevered and completed the performance. Nina's arms began to mutate, her fingers transforming into feathers. As the melody swirled, she spun relentlessly on stage, gradually morphing into a true black swan. Her flawless performance earned thunderous applause from the audience. To secure this role, Nina had a heated argument with her rival, Lily. In a moment of desperation, Nina believed she had killed Lily. However, after the performance, Lily reappeared, congratulating her on a successful show. Nina realized it was all a hallucination. Shockingly, the wound was on Nina herself, she hadn't killed Lily at all. With no other choice, Nina continued to prepare herself in front of the mirror. Then came the third act, titled The Death of the White Swan. As Nina danced, the wound spread. Holding back tears, she leapt from the stage. Her poignant portrayal earned a standing ovation. It was only then that the instructor noticed the wound on Nina's abdomen. Nina had brilliantly interpreted the black swan, but at the cost of losing herself. 